Hey, hey, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Virtual Road Trip. Uh, this is part two of our little journey here through the Schoharie Valley. And uh, for this episode, there's actually going to be uh, quite a bit of hiking involved, so this uh, video is a little longer than the previous one. And uh, yeah, it's going to start here with a little driving, and then we're going to visit another waterfall, my favorite, of course. And then we'll finish it off with the uh, rest of the drive through the valley. So, enjoy. The first place we're going to visit here is uh, the Schoharie Reservoir. Now, unfortunately, I wasn't able to get a very good look at it because uh, they're doing a lot of construction on the dam that holds the whole thing together. And uh, they basically blocked off the open view that used to be there, at least as I remember it. So I had to get a little bit of a view through the trees for a short distance, but we'll be able to see most of it since it's a rather small reservoir as we uh, cross the bridge over the Schoharie Creek that exits the reservoir. Quick view of the uh, dam, if you can see it up there. Uh, they're doing a lot of work, as you can see, digging out the whole area to reinforce it. Back on Route 30 here, heading north. Um, pretty soon we'll be coming up to our hiking spot, the uh, Minekill Falls. So yeah, another waterfall. Uh, it's uh, my favorite place to hike always, and uh, I think it's going to be pretty nice. Uh, I've been getting a fair amount of rain lately, so water should be flowing pretty good. And um, they uh, built a nice uh, platform to view the waterfall from, and uh, I got some good footage, so you'll enjoy. Wow, these are nice steps here. Look at this. Right now we're going to hike down and get a closer look at the lower waterfall. Trail's not too bad. 
Yeah, bitch getting back up. back on the road now. Uh, hope you enjoyed the hike. And uh, we're back on Route 30 heading north. And uh, we're really going to be getting into the uh, heart of the Schoharie Valley here pretty soon. Uh, you'll see things really widen out. Nice uh, farmland around. It's, uh, it's a really beautiful So this is the uh, little town of Blenheim, New York. Um, up here, unfortunately, I would love to be able to pull over and show you what used to be one of the longest covered bridges in the Northeast um, that used to cross the Schoharie Creek right here, but sadly in 2011 it was destroyed by Hurricane Irene, much like uh, a lot of things around here, including Prattsville, which we went through earlier. This area was just uh, devastated. And um, losing that covered bridge really sucks, because it was pretty cool.
So I'm not really sure where I'm going to go for my next trip. Um, if it's going to be somewhere more close to home or branch out a little more. I'm thinking maybe something uh, a little bit south of me perhaps because I've been going north uh, north and west for the most part so far. Um, it's kind of tough, you know, working full time and can't devote every weekend to long drives as much as I'd like to, but uh, we'll see where I end up. Uh, but I'll be sure to uh, try to get a new video out to everybody as soon as possible. And uh, Wherever I go, it'll be uh, nice and relaxing, I assure you. Crossing the Schoharie Creek yet again, so as it winds and meanders through the valley. Hard to believe such a little creek created such a wide valley, but that's what happens when you be given enough time. Not much further, I'll be uh, turning around and heading back towards home, but uh, if you were to continue north on Route 30, eventually you'd uh, end up crossing the uh, throughway on Route ni uh, Interstate 90, the Mohawk River, and you'd end up in the Adirondacks. And if you kept going after that, eventually you'd end up in Canada. So this road is a pretty long road. It goes to the entire state, kind of like right up the middle almost. The uh, flat mountainside you can see just ahead is actually called Vermin's Nose, and uh, it's kind of a well-known hiking spot in these parts. Definitely worth checking out if you're in this area. Pretty soon we'll be uh, getting to Middleburg, New York, which will be our final destination. So uh, that's going to do it for this video and uh, this trip altogether. Really hope you enjoyed it. It was uh, a little longer than usual, but uh, I think it was worth it. As always, uh, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and um, hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.